Hello YouTube community. Welcome to new episode series. This one is yet unnamed, but we are going to find that out as we start to listen to what I have to say and reflect and hear my words. I have reached a crossroads in my life where I am internally clashing with myself. I am trying to figure out what is right and what is wrong and hoping and praying that I choose the right path. I am trying to devote myself to a higher cause, something that nobody has really aimed to achieve besides mainstream rappers and journalists that have lost their perception of reality. For with them lacks authenticity and it's really hard to generate something once you've lost it. I have reached a point in my life where my breath feels so exhausting from holding what is inside that I often forget who I am. I forget my journey on this planet and my desire to become one, to become great and whole. Self-doubt and shame for being myself is something that I've learned to be a part of that accompany me. For I have seen it so often. I have hurt other people for neglecting them. I have wondered why love has not been in my life. And I've been ignorant to myself. I've been so caught up in the moment that I've forgotten to enjoy the life, the life that's living, and that's me. I forgot to appreciate what is important and to see the light and to be great again. It has been a long journey of drugs and experimentations and trying to derive my chemistry. And I have written all of this down. I have taken notes. I have studied. I have devoted my life to conquering this crisis of mental illness that has been placed upon me through drugs. And this journey is one that may have saddened me at a time, but now makes me proud and makes me captivated and fulfilled. For I could say that drugs are of my past and drugs are no longer present. They have no importance in life. This allows me to place more important things on the forefront.
this allows me to connect with nature and lavish in mud to respect my elders for it is fun it's something that I don't have to consider a task anymore to live life it's something that I can move forward with you because you have been at the forefront of it all. You have experienced it with me. You have seen my journey. You have seen my story. I feel like I have been misunderstood with you and Maybe it was because I had a lack of attention towards you and I apologize for that. But you have to understand that I did this so that you would understand the struggle that every person who is combating mental illness goes through. The struggle to maintain an identity. The struggle to have a voice. The struggle to not know what is right from wrong. The struggle of not being able to just fall in the snow and enjoy yourself and live life. Or if you could do that right now, you are blessed and you are one of the community. There is no need to shame me or guilt me or shame other people or guilt other people or think down upon mental illness because mental illness is an ailment of the ill, of the self. I'll explain it to you in my words. It is something that starts within. The doubt of society. The doubt of having a purpose. For not having a purpose is the root of it all. Of not living life is of doubt when you call. For the words that I speak true, you will see it. For a prophecy has to come. To speak of a tale that is so true that it throws you into a loop. That you start to understand a figmented mind.